is time for another grocery order, you guys. It is time for another grocery order. Again, I'm in Walmart, Walmart today. We really only shop Walmart because my husband gets discount. So let's go another food stamp grocery haul, you guys. I forgot my camera at home, so I'm using my my phone. Okay, hiccups. I was doing some Uber driving today. I think I'll stick with the Amazon Flex because I'm like, what? Then I got like, guys, I got like $50. No, $46. Almost $50. And just in four hours. That's insane. I think I'll stick, stick with the Amazon Flex, guys. It's so much better. Yeah, let's go. Let's go get these groceries. In Walmart today, guys. <sighs> Heading to Walmart. I just drove for like four hours. I'm going to doing driving and food deliveries. And I had I had a catering order for deliver that. Um but total it was like with the Uber it was forty six what forty six fifty. Totally not worth it. Um I don't know, they didn't give me a tip. What the hell? That was actually my first deliver that order and they didn't give me a tip. I don't know if it comes like after. But Maybe let the, at the end of the day, I'll see if they give me a tip. But so far, they didn't give me a tip. And for what you have to do, like, so much food, and you have to set up, like, catering style, I don't think that's worth it. But let's go shopping at Walmart, you guys. So, I went to the bathroom. At least the bathroom been driving for a while. But as soon as I walked in here, into the Walmart, there was this, like, alarm. And I think it was the fire alarm. And the guy at the door, the guy at the door said it was like a test. So I'm like, okay, well, I'm going to keep shopping then because the fire alarm, like, that would scare anybody. The fire alarm is going off right when you walk in. And so when I went to the bathroom, there was these, like, there were there was old ladies in the bathroom. And they were, like, they were trying to figure out what the noise was to and they were panicking. So I explained to them, like, it was just like a fire drill. Oh, poor things, they were panicking. But I'm gonna go, I'm gonna start from the back here. Start from the back. I don't know why I came down here to the yogurt. I don't need any yogurt. My daughter still has yogurt from before. I don't know why I came back here. We don't need any yogurt. I'm recording on my phone, guys. I can't believe I left my camera at home, but I sure did. Oh, I saw the manager. They call them coaches at Walmart. I saw the manager, and I used to work here, so she was like, she was like, you ready to come back? And I was like, you know what? I put in that application like two months ago. Um, and then she said, oh, for what? And I said, and I said, um, for, I don't know, it was different. It was different applications. I just did part-time for whatever I just did part-time for whatever was available and then she said oh really you want to be a cashier and I said you know what I have no problem being a cashier but part-time because you guys I can't stand out too long and I have to take and I have to take the breaks like I have to take a lot of breaks because my feet like hurt a lot and my uh, lymphedema is not really good so I have to take a lot of breaks so she she was like, oh, okay, and then, like, she legit just walked away. She didn't even tell me, like, anything else. I don't know, maybe she went to go pull up my application. But, yeah, she didn't tell me anything else. But it's almost October, guys. I can't wait for them to bring back eggnog because I really miss the eggnog. Love eggnog during Christmas time. I can't wait for them to bring that back because it's so good. But, yeah, I'm wondering, now I'm wondering if she went to go pull up my pull up my application because like I said I used to work here before and they really loved me here I wonder if she went to go pull up my application um yeah that would be perfect instead of like driving around doing Uber and Amazon and everything we really just need money to pay the car insurance and the car my husband can pay for everything else and being as we get food stamps now, that really helps out a lot because it's just, I don't know, guys, it really helps out a lot. A lot of people would, like, be, like, questioning, like, oh, why are you happy about getting food stamps? 
um, I've been paying for food nonstop every week for the last 13 years. So I'm ecstatic, okay? I'm ecstatic and excited about getting food stamps. So people, you know, people in my comments are gonna be like, oh, why are you sorry about that? Because that's why, food is so expensive. Food is so expensive. So whatever money we can like save, that's awesome. So I'm hoping she wants to go pull my application. That'll be awesome. I love this Walmart too. This Walmart is like the best one around here. I get some, my daughter still has her ice cream. I get some waffles. I'm gonna get some buttermilk waffles. Ooh, really cold, you guys. Or it's just my hands. I'm just so weak. My goodness. Get some waffles. And we don't need any butter. We don't need any cheese we don't need any ketchup we don't need any condiments we don't need any soda we don't need any drinks uh let's see let's see let's see okay i do need air freshener and i really just i don't know i probably go for just the dollar tree for them but driving two places and then I don't know. I think it would just be better to get it here because then my husband can get discount too. So that's perfect. Three twenty-four for her money. Put it down and count one count. Oh, so this is this one. Yeah, I sure did forget my camera. I sure did, but thank goodness this phone has an awesome camera. Okay, so I'm gonna get this Hawaiian freshener. We need a lot of fresheners because the cat, the cat is a menace. Okay, go that way. Uh, Hawaiian. Here is a Hawaiian. And then this one, Twilight Woods, is good. Yeah, the cat, oh my god. When he uses the bathroom, we have the litter that's supposed to make it, like, smell good when he covers it. But I feel like it just doesn't work. Like, he... Oh my god, you guys. This cat legit stinks. Huh? He stinks so bad. Get another one of these. He stinks so bad. This is 97 cents. You see, I would have went to the Dollar Tree for no reason. The Dollar 25 at the Dollar Tree, and this was 97 cents. So that was awesome. Okay. Next. What's on my list next? I'm going to get these sausage things here. Uh, where is it? Small sausage. What's this one? Pork, turkey, beef. Is it this one? I think it's this one. I remember, my daughter said she wanted these. Okay, sausage down. Checked. Oh, we need the snacks. Guys, these kids are. My kids are homeschooled, so they're like during this. Pub from public school, kids go back to school. They're not eating as much as home, but. My kids are homeschooled, so just like the summer when public school kids were um, home during the summer, they were eating a lot. Well, my kids eat a lot during the entire year. So, oh, family premium crackers. My daughter requested the crackers. And they only have one box. Only one box. I was going to get two. I only have one. Okay, and I'm gonna get her goldfish. The big goldfish. <sighs> These children's snackings are expensive. Oh, I almost forgot her seeds. She asked me for seeds before, and I didn't remember, so now I remember the seeds. Let's see if I can reach it. I am super short. My fall on my head. I got it. I got this. I got it. I got it. No, don't got it. Okay, it's moving. Okay, I got it. I got it, guys. Got the seeds for her. David seeds. Okay. And now the cheeses. My son requests the cheeses. He only likes the original. 
He won't eat any other one. I get two boxes of these. He still has a lot of animal crackers. Let me get these cheeses for him. And then my daughter requested some Oreos. I get those in the same aisle. They are requesting popcorn, but I am not buying any more popcorn. You guys, when I buy popcorn, I feel like it just goes all over the floor. And it just makes a complete huge mess. So I'm going to buy my daughter these cookies. Uh, she requested three of them. I have to buy two. And then Pringles. Oh, snacks, snacks, snacks. A lot of snacks needed. Again, my kids are homeschooled, so they snack a lot. I do not give my kids a limit on going inside the, the um, on getting, you know, you know, telling them to get out of the kitchen. They're hungry. Go for the damn food. Okay, totally fine. Because I know if I'm hungry. I'm gonna go for the food too, so might as well. Cheeto puffs, onions, um, salt and vinegar, and Doritos. And then my husband eats the plane chips and get some of those for him. This camera is awesome, you guys. Maybe I should use my phone camera from now on. This camera is awesome. Okay, he eats these plain potato chips here. Sour cream and onion. And regular gravy potato chips. And I think he still has sauce at home. So, I'm going to the shrimp now. We eat so much shrimp, guys. We don't eat, we don't eat like meat, like chicken and beef and everything. We only eat that when we go to Pizza Ranch on Tuesdays. If you're new here, we go to Pizza Ranch mostly every Tuesday um, because the kids eat free. But other than that, this is only the kind of protein that they eat, shrimp. And so I'm going to buy, I'm going to buy, oh, is there a big one? Is there a big one down here? Uh, Alright. You're gonna get three of these. Yes, that. This is the only protein that they eat. Three bags of shrimp. That's 100 to 150. Uh, it's peeled. Uh, peeled and divine. The tail is off. Perfect because my autistic son doesn't like peeling these things. And I'm gonna get some crab. Once a month crab. Some crab. Um, that is so crazy. The snow crab is cheaper than the dungeon crab. That is, guys, that's crazy. Like the snow crab is cheaper. How much is the Atlantic crab? 24. That one's two pounds. I don't know how much it is. This one is one pound eight ounces. The Dungeons Crab is one pound. That's 16 ounces. That's crazy that it's, that it's more though. The King Crab is 40 bucks, guys. Woo. Okay. We need more salmon. My husband and I have been eating salmon. Uh, I kind of want, I want the skin off. I haven't been able to find that one. Skinless? Is that it? It's $17, so that's insane. Dude, I'd rather pay the ten forty eight and just peel the skin off myself. That totally saves so much money. Just a little bit more work and that's totally fine. Next, I need hamburger buns. My husband likes these beef patty things that he eats with the hamburger buns. So I'm going to get some hamburger buns. Hamburger bones. 
I'm puffing it. Look at the date. So I'm gonna explain so soon. September 22nd. Perfect. September 22nd. Get two of these. And my keys are just making so much noise. September 21st and September 22nd. That's perfect. And now get some white bread. Look at the date. September 21st. Perfect. Guys, my sister just gave birth to two twins. And she was a surrogate for um, these parents. And she just gave birth to two twins. And her birthday is coming up. Her birthday is on the 13th. And that is so awesome that she had them before her birthday. Like, just like a cool birthday present. Isn't that cool? She had twins. She's a surrogate, surrogate for somebody else. I think that's completely awesome. That's so amazing when people are willing to do that. Unfortunately, I can't do that myself because I did have my tubes taken out, not tied. So I can't, I won't ever go back and I can't have any more kids, even with in vitro. So I wouldn't be able to do surrogacy. And with my health, with my health, I don't think I'll be able to do that anyway. But it's so cool that she's able to do that. I'm going to get some cherry Pop-Tarts over here. They have the Pop-Tarts here in two different places. Don't know why. But I'm going to grab some cherry Pop-Tarts here for my daughter. Okay. See, they have them back there. And they have them over here, guys. Isn't that crazy? They have them in two different places. I don't know why. Interesting. Alright, my kids don't eat cereal, so I don't need any cereal. So we're moving on. So we are down the soup aisle, guys. And I wanted to see if I could find some soy sauce. Yes, jump right out to me. I've been eating brown rice and I'm not liking it. I'm hoping the soy sauce would make it <coughs> excuse me. Hoping the soy sauce would make it taste better. Because I don't like it. It's just a weird taste to me. But I can't eat the regular rice anymore. Um, I'm going to get some shrimp noodles for my daughter. Oh yeah. Shrimp noodles for my daughter. And then my son requested some ravioli. I think that's in the next aisle. That is in the next aisle. Okay, we are down the pasta aisle now. And my son requested some ravioli. So I'm going to go ahead and get him some ravioli. Some mini raviolis. Um, and the spaghetti and meatballs. He likes these. Spaghetti and meatballs. And the mini ravioli. One of each. Oh, I don't want to put it on the chips. I didn't realize how I was packing here. Look what I did, you guys. I didn't realize how I was packing here. Anyway, it's totally fine. Alright, we're moving on. I don't think I needed anything else down here. My daughter already has a bunch of elbow macaroni um, for her baked macaroni, so she doesn't need that. Oh, I do need something else down here. The tuna is down here. I'm getting two, two cans of tuna here. Or two packs of tuna, seven ninety eight, or I think it's four. Oh, eight cans for seven ninety eight. Okay, so that's what I needed in this aisle. Now I'm gonna come back, come back and talk to you guys because I need to look at my list, see what else I needed. So I did have to go back to the um get the noodles, I forgot the beef noodles, and I needed brown rice. So, next aisle. This one is the condiments, right, and the canned vegetables. Oh, hi. So, I'm gonna go down here and get some green beans, some peas, and some carrots. Excuse me. Okay, so she doesn't need any um, any ketchup, so we're not going to get that, but we're going to get some peas, peas and green beans. She likes the, like the, I know what you call it. She likes these green beans, like the ones that are whole. She doesn't like the sliced ones. So, green beans, 
we're gonna get three of those. And they're 64 cents each. Green beans, corn, corn for me. They don't eat corn. I'm gonna get three corns. Of course, my husband is talking because he's a social butterfly. I love interaction. I don't know. My kids and I, or my kids are like me. We don't like all that interaction. Okay, got the corn, the peas. The peas are 64 cents each shoe. I'm gonna get three of these. And then the last thing I needed was the carrots. The last thing I needed was the carrots. Um, do they not have them in the big can? Carrots, carrots. Well, the carrots are up there, 96 cents. Oh, I'm gonna buy the little one. Eh, I'll buy the big one. Sliced carrots for 96 cents. Let's see those. I got the bonds. So he's getting some sweet potato I things. I got the chips. Oh, is that sour cream and the regular plain ones? Is that the one you like? Sour cream is so. You don't like sour cream? No, do you get the kids chips? Yeah. No. I got sour cream, no. so you don't want sour cream. Okay, well, I mean, change that one then. Get that but I gotta get some. Okay, so he's got this double cheese potatoes, he baked potato thing. He likes those. Um, I got the carrots. We have beans. Uh, I think that's all for the condiments, you guys. Let's see what I needed in the produce. Oh, mushrooms. I'm gonna try this. I usually buy the mushrooms produce. I'm gonna try the can. See how that tastes. How much is this? No, I'm not gonna try nothing. Ooh, that's way too much for my pocket. I'm sure. not spending more than a dollar on that. Alright, let's go to the produce. Go to the produce. Right, going to the produce. So I need more cabbage. I need a bag. I need some bags. Okay, let me get some bags first. My husband got these ice creams, vanilla fudge, vanilla chocolate, vanilla caramel. I got a lemonade and we got some potatoes. So this is our shopping. We did shopping before, but we didn't do too much. So we were like, oh my god. How do we need food? But it's because we didn't do too much. Awesome food stamp haul, snacks, and healthy foods, and entrees. Guys, this is awesome. They're still building that thing. Yeah, it's well, gonna be a temp. Building. It's what? I thought it was gonna be um. It's going to be a temp agency, guys. And I'm going to need to go there. Okay guys, we are all done ringing. The total is 286.47. Let's see how much that discount is. The discount was $4.20. I'm going to pay $225 in my food stamp card. 